y'all want to send a message that y'all are as good as, as advertised? Uh, we just try to play to our standard, you know, and play Bama ball, Bama ball, you know, play to the standard, and we know what that standard is. So just try to, you know, hold, hold each other accountable and play to our standard. What do back-to-back shutouts in the SEC mean for this defense? Uh, it, means, it, mean, it means a lot, but obviously we still have some work to do, you know. Um, you just got to get better each and every week. As the offense was putting up all those points early on the season, I mean, I guess people probably tend to forget about the defense. I mean, how much do you feel like you guys have kind of, you know, reasserted yourselves as kind of, you know, one of the best in the nation, I guess? Um, the offense, they do a good job, you know, of, you know, taking care of the ball and, you know, putting up big numbers, you know. But as defense, you know, we just try to go out and, you know, uh, compete with each other, you know, and, you know, hold each other accountable, you know, to everything else. How do you hold it up? each other accountable? Um, by, you know, making sure everybody uh, on the on the same page, communicating, getting the right call, you know, um, looking each other in the eye and, you know, sending, sending the calls back. How much do you think that the communication has improved? Uh, it definitely has improved a whole, a, a whole lot. Um, we still have, you know, still can communicate a lot better, you know, but it, it has improved a lot. When the defensive line can get pressure with just four guys, how much does that help you all in the back? When the defensive line can get pressure with just three or four guys, how much does that help you guys in the back? Uh, end? It helps us a lot, you know. Um, big shout out to the D line, you know, they hold us down in the back end, you know, make our job easy. Was that a big key for you guys being able to stop Fitzgerald today? Um, yeah, you know, uh, we come, we came into the game, knew he liked to run the ball, mm-hmm. so you know, uh, the D line did a good job trying to, you know, hold. Uh, well, they did a good job trying to, you know, get to the quarterback, which they did, you know, and have us uh, have an easier job in the back end. Coach mentioned that uh, get, sorry, <laughs> sorry, getting all that pressure with just four down defensive linemen was pretty important. Is that a message that you guys are trying to continue on throughout the rest of the year? Uh, yeah, the D-line been doing a good job all year, you know, and we trying to, you know, keep that going, you know, for them, and we trying to make their job easy in the back, you know, by not letting anybody get open. And they try to, you know, do a good, good job up front, you know, getting to the quarterback and uh, second the quarterback real fast. Did you have to mix your coverage as much today, or did you pretty much stay base? Um, you know, we had to uh, adjust a couple times, you know, um, but, you know, it wasn't nothing real serious, but we, we, adjust, we made adjustments then. <laughs> kind of like what you expected, or, mm-hmm. or yeah. you knew what they were basically going to do? That yeah. Works. Mm-hmm. Okay. The defense itself wasn't able to force a turnover today. That yeah. Is that something y'all work on? Uh, yeah, definitely. Um, we, you know, we try to reach our goal on, you know, getting turnovers every week, you know, and we didn't force one today, so we kind of, you know, at each other about that a lot in the locker room, you know, that we got to come out, you know, and pra- we got to practice it first, you know, that would lead, that would lead us over into the game, getting a turnover. Did Mississippi State do anything special to kind of, you know, put more emphasis on holding on to the ball or anything? Why do you think that happened? Uh, nah, I mean, the quarterback, he did a good job, you know, taking care of the ball, you know. Um, I feel like we uh, we could have, you know, uh, made plays on the ball and, and uh, doing a couple of plays. So, I mean, he did a good job taking care of the ball. How do you think going up against Alabama's offense when good on good drills has helped you guys improve to maybe become the defense that you guys are right now? Um, going up against those guys every day, man, it's, it's, it's hard, you know, because you know, they read the tour and Jalen and Mac Jones, they all read the coverages and, you know, they can make all the throws. And, you know, it's hard going up against those guys, you know, even the receivers, you know, and it, it better us and it better, it better them. So, it's hard.